It's 8.15am and I'm going to start my day today with a spin. Phew, thought it was going to be another one of those days again when the spin bike timer was just not working at all, but we've got it, got it back on track. So, fingers crossed, it keeps going. Um, yeah, I only need to rack up about two miles or so and then I will be completing the medal that um, I set myself for indoor spinning this year. So that's why I'm up early, trying to get these two miles done and dusted before the day begins. Right round, round, round. And this is my mantra for the day. I gotta get through this. I gotta get through this. minutes six kilometers yeah I can do that for today because I do just need to go and check that teams is still gonna be able to work for me later on and I have the opportunity to do that with the um, one of the panelists that I should be speaking to later on for my interview so I'm gonna go and do that now okay spin done so now let's find out if the hot tub has kept it hot Oh yeah, it's heated, it's heated, it's definitely heated, no cold spots, oh yeah, oh, good to enjoy this then. Oh yes, lovely and warm, which means the heater's working, so it's not broke, so I won't have to buy a new one, thank goodness for that. And now I'll just sit back, relax, enjoy it, and set my intentions for the rest of the day. Which will be focusing on the interview later on today and of course last minute packing for our trip. Oh to be a bee to hop tree to tree to live wild and free oh to be a bee getting ready to zoom rather to teams <laughs> 10 minutes away I suppose I ought to log on I'm looking forward to this like a hole in my head I have to say I don't do interviews I can't do interviews. I can't remember a thing. I get tongue-tied. But here goes nothing. Which one are you to? Was that your headphones when you were reaching for that? Yeah, it's just putting it down. Just checking I was in the right room again. Because <laughs> <laughs> we could hear you and see you clearly. And it looks like you and I are in the same place. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Both zend out, yeah. <laughs> Great text. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> uh, lovely to meet you. Would you prefer you. cows or cows? Uh, cows, if you would, please. Cows, yeah, cows is fine. Um, it's done. It's over. I've survived. And so there it was. <laughs> My first in the rear in 12 years. Um, definitely my first interview across a team's um, application. Still just as nervy because you can still get tongue-tied and still freeze and forget what you wanted to say. But luckily I had my notes to keep me on track, which is something we never used to have in a real interview. <laughs> you had to just waffle face to face, which is probably why. The last few interviews I went for I never got because boy did I waffle. Anyway, <laughs> how do I think it went? Oh, I wouldn't like to say. I couldn't say. It seemed to go all right. 
lots of smiles and nods and good answers but we all say that don't we whether we mean it or not that's something i would have once not realized that but obviously the benefit of raising children you realize that you praise them even perhaps when they don't um i won't say don't need to be praised because that doesn't sound right but we often put false praise there just to uh, make them feel good and um you often wonder now if everybody does it at all the time to make people feel good so therefore you can't really judge as to whether that was successful or unsuccessful I've got my fingers crossed but you know I don't know how many other applicants they've got I know I was the last one and I know I'll find out on Tuesday at the latest good or bad so it will either make my holiday or ruin my holiday. Let's see. Hopefully it's going to make my holiday. But if it doesn't, I won't be too disappointed onwards and upwards. And I will find something else. In September.